Get a lot of customers tonight? Not if you don't move out of the way, I don't. Hey, taxi! Take me to Finman House in Fishmouth. Yeah, that's real funny. Let's waste the cabbie's time with dumb jokes. No, I'm serious. Take me to Fishmouth. We don't go to Fishmouth. I'll pay double. You can pay four times the fare. It ain't worth going there. You think darkum has been strange lately? Wait till you get a whiff of Fishmouth. So let's get a whiff. Money can't make me go there, friend. Them fishy folks will scare the scales off an anchovy. Look, I have this suspicious cookie. Keep that thing away from me. Some darn hippie fed me one of those about a month ago. I was seeing tentacles and all kinds of ungodly things for a week after. You don't say. I have this talking cat. We all gotta crush the bear, buddy. Amen, brother. Can I interest you in an ancient cursed grimoire? Nah, already got one of those. And it's full of my wife's special occasion dresses. What can I do for a ride to Fishmouth? Well, I do have a family problem needs taken care of, but, uh... Man, it's a heck of a doozy, let me tell you. I'm all ears. Uh... See, this cousin of mine, Ed, married a woman out of Fishmouth. Fishmouth, can you believe it? Name's Azanath. Anyway, ever since they got together, every time I meet old Eddie, I get this strange feeling he's, uh... He's not himself. Always shopping for groceries, never goes to the ball game anymore. General zombie-like complexion, lack of will to go on. That's pretty common from what I understand. No, oh, you unmarried folks always piling on the stereotypes. No, friend, I mean, and I know it sounds crazy. It's like she's looking at me through his eyes. Like she's the one inside, right? Whoa, okay. So, where's he? Good question, buddy. I mean, possession. That's crazy talk, I know, but I've seen it with my own eyes, man. Now, he ain't talking much, but from what he did say, he gets littler and littler time as himself every day. And I'm worried sick, man. Look, I don't know what your deal is, but get rid of Azanet for me, and I'll drive your butt to Fishmouth like it was nothing. Quest unlocked. I mean, deal. Okay, then. What can you tell me about Ed? Name's Edward. Edward Derby. He's my cousin, supports the tentacles, don't care much for light beer or garlic-based toppings. Thanks, that's very insightful. What can you tell me about Asenath? What's there to say? She's a creepy one, that's for sure. Looking like a darn fish if I ever saw one. I've been driving cabs forever, and I never heard of anyone else called Asenath in Darkham, so there's that. Hope that'll help you. Thanks. Okay, got it. Got a scoot. Voodoo gentlemen, I need you to help me help someone out. Oh no, whose life is the Necronomicon ruined now? N no nothing like that. There's this cabbie outside, and his cousin's body is apparently being possessed by his wife, Asenath. It's like he swaps bodies with his wife against his will. Wife swapping? That's crazy. Yeah, anyway, help me help his cousin get rid of this Asenath character. Hmm, well, since I can't help change your cat back, I might as well give you a hand with this possessing business. Actual voodoo freaking magic? My special brand of it, yes. We will need to craft a personalized voodoo spell. You're getting a platinum package deal here, buddy. I fear a fetch quest is in order. You'll need a doll, well, that goes without saying. Then you'll need something that cuts, chops, or severs. And finally someone, how can I put this? Attractive. 
we're not talking chopping attractive people's limbs off here, right? Oh no, I have one motto. Do no physical harm. Oh, oh, and uh, one more thing. You need to look up the order we will use them in. What do you mean, no physical harm? I only deal in figurative voodoo. Sounds like some new age hippie load of... Oh, you'll be a believer by the time we're done. Can't you get the items yourself? No, it is very important that I sit here and do nothing. It's in the terms of service. Want to read them? Uh, no thanks. I think I'll just agree. Yeah, I thought so. You have some dolls around. Can't we use one of them? That's my private collection, Buzz. No touchy. But I don't know where to get a doll at this hour. Oh, it's easier than you think. Like taking candy from a baby. Found these scissors. Good eye. Found this picture of a male model. A strapping young man. It'll do. Found this book called A Very Convenient Treatise on the Order Voodoo Magic Ingredients Should Be Used In. Think it might help? It might. Have you read it yet? Not yet. I'll get back to you. Gotta run. I'll be here, Buzz. Hmm, let's see. Okay, according to this treatise, I think the order we should use the items is someone attractive, doll, thing that cuts. scared or anything I just don't you you talk to her okay nice doll you have there Priscilla this stupid old thing it doesn't even look like mommy and daddy anymore I don't even want to know what that's supposed to mean so what can I do to get that doll of yours what the heck do you need a doll for at this hour you creep never you mind Priscilla I don't want anything but my fishy back I can't reach it from down here. Hey, Kitty, how about you climb up and get that fishy for me? Really, Buzz? What's in it for us? Another doll in exchange for it. Your preoccupations are a constant source of wonderment and worry, but okay, we're quid pro quoing. All right, Miss Know-It-All, I think we need to have a talk about you helping out whenever I consider it necessary. Geez, fine. You were right this time, okay? Sheesh. So, from now on, you'll help out when I tell you to? Ask me to. And that's a maybe. Let's say I'll be more inclined to. Ah, <sighs> I'll take it. All right, Priscilla, here's your fishy. Let me have the doll. Hmm. Deal, creep. This town, man, this freaking town. Hmm, let's... Okay, according to this treatise, I think the order we should use the... I Found a doll! You mean mercilessly ripped from the hands of an innocent child, don't you? Alright, what do you want to call it? Asenath. Asenath it is. So, that was all of them, huh? Indeed it was. All right, now this is important. 
Which order should we use them in? Picture, doll, scissors. All right, here we go. Jambalaya. Um, okay, what just happened? Azanath just lost her head over some male model dude. I told you, I deal in figurative voodoo. Should have seen it coming. Do you think it worked? I know it worked. Thank you, VG. Enough respect, B. So, everything seems to have worked out in the end, huh? Well, not everything, but yeah, it's a start. Gonna go change Kitty back now. You do that. Please. See you soon. Not too soon, I hope. from Ed lately? You, you're good. <laughs> nah, it was nothing. No, 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 you're good. You're very good. Just got off the phone with Ed. Azanet left him for a male model. My God, I don't know how you did it, but you did it. <laughs> Thanks. So, wanna go to Fishmouth? Want? No, but I'm a man of my word, friend. Get in. We're off to Stinkville. Hear that, Kitty? Adventure awaits. I can barely contain my enthusiasm. Oh, you'll love it. Seafood as far as the eye can see. Oh, brother. Alrighty, here goes nothing. <laughs>